So, Joel, Misty Island or Forbidden Jungle? Let's go Actually, I just realized I have to go to the Forbidden Jungle to go to Misty Island. All of Forbidden Jungle or Misty Island? Uh, I was going to say Forbidden Jungle. Okay, we'll, do, we'll just do Forbidden Jungle. Sonic Speed! <laughs> and out of Sonic Speed. Damn it all! <laughs> so, Joel, Forbidden Jungle or Forbidden Jungle? Uh, I'll take the Forbidden Jungle. Ah, Forbidden Jungle for 100 points. Nice. Like, how much them, like, how much them points, like, actually worth? Huh? A cent a piece. That's like a dollar. Nice, I can get a candy bar with that. Well, I think I might get screwed on tax now. <laughs> Damn it. So, like, so unrighteous. If I go to Rice and Hole, maybe I can get like a cheap piece of cheap pack of gum. It's still pretty righteous. Yeah. Oh, look, it's the fisherman, man. Like, Not a damn thing because I suck at fishing. So, Lurker Shark bit the bit the tar out of his boat, like, um, num, num, num. So he's all like, oh, I'll go catch fish upstream. Except he sucks at fishing. Everyone in Sandlot Sand Village suck at their own jobs. Except for Samos. And the name of the love interest, who I don't know the name of. Walters, come back there. No. No, Wally, no. Yeah, in the chicken. Come boy. Go on, boy. Come on, boy. Go on. He went outside. Do I want to fish? Alright, so essentially, he tells us that there are green and gold fish. However, there are also purple eels. If you catch a single eel, you lose. Also, if you miss too many fishes, then he also disqualifies you. I think he said something about Mr. Five. But if you get an eel, I'll punch you in the dick. <laughs> if you get an eel, I will castrate you. I hope you didn't have any love interests. <laughs> uh, <laughs> what the hell happened with that other one right there? It, I, I, it touched like the side of my net and went inside of it. I smacked it with my net and it went like in. It went like in, so you know. I can't remember how many I can't miss. I think it's five. If I had to catch 200 pounds of fish. Oh yeah, these are all eels. Except for that one. Um. Oh. I almost caught an eel right there. It's like you get 199 you get an eel. Oh! Wait. I've done that. I've gotten 196 and gotten an eel once. Um, um, um. Steady boy. Steady boy. Cause boy, Steady. you get a damn eel. I'm gonna go punch you. That's not Maybe he means 10 pounds. Oh, I did it. I think it's, you missed 10 pounds of fish, is what it was. Which meant if you miss a gold one, he really messed you up. But yeah, there we go. First try. Booyah. First try. Yeah. One man. What? 200 pounds of fish. No eel. I just realized I could put this on my head, actually, and it could still heal you perfectly fine and not hurt the side of my head as a result. I just hear a reverberation of myself talking. Uh, thank God, because that was actually kind of hurting my head after a while. Because it was crooked, so it was like up against like this the wall. Oh, you're what? digging up against the freaking hip, the hip that's digging into you. Yeah. What's weird is I also hear like I hear you as if I'm hearing you. Yeah, I'm hearing the the, the reverb of the recording, so I'm hearing the reverb of you as well. So it's like I'm hearing you twice. Logic, though. <laughs> the logic. Headphones, can you please logic? Uh, sure. Hold on for a second. Sorry, that would cost. That would mean we would have a budget, and we don't have one of those. Bitch. I know martial arts, motherfucker. We interrupt this program to bring you the jungle. Sure, you can. We interrupt this program to bring you 
the jungle book. I just murdered that snake. What's the snake's name in the jungle book? Uh. Well, I mean, whoever he was, he's, he's really, really dead now. <laughs> okay, okay, I got this. Trust me. Shit. Why was I bothering to do that? There's a way to jump up here over here. Oh, frog. Froggy. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my God. Imagine the demonic big cat. Oh, my God. Your nightmares have become true. Like, everyone who doesn't like big just instantly got angry. You mean everyone? Uh. Everyone ever? Who legitimately... Oh, no! <laughs> who legitimately liked Big the Cat? I want to know. Also, I just realized... I can actually hear the uh, reversion on the back. The playback. Maybe I want to turn this down a little bit. Where's the... Uh... Uh. Ah! Almost got hit. I almost ruined my perfect playthrough. Don't get hit at all. It's never gonna happen, but it would be really funny. What the is goal this? Definitely cry. Don't get hit. Yeah. <laughs> Good luck with that. Oh no, that's 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 called Dante don't must die mode. Oh no no, I'm sorry. That's called heaven in hell mode. Gotcha. Where you literally can't get hit. But everything else in Heaven and Hell Heaven Heaven and Hell mode is also um a one shot. Man, have you ever done the European hard mode? Um, I've tried. tried. I know what you're talking about. You're talking about that mode where you can't even get spotted or it's immediate game over yeah. in Metal Gear Solid. That, I couldn't even get past the first area of enemies. I got past the first area of enemies, I didn't get any further than that. So for Pretty much, if you do that mode, you have to kill the crap out of anything and everything you see. Or just be the ultimate fucking stealth god. Oh, yeah. You need to be stealth god or just a murderous prick. And even being a murderous prick, you have to be really, really careful with being a murderous prick because if you murder someone the wrong way, they're gonna notice you're there. If you get too hasty with killing someone. Yeah, I think, the, in my opinion, out of Metal Gear Solid 3, my favorite area is the map. Uh, I didn't get much further than the mountains, so I can't give you a huge opinion on my, uh... I don't know why I like the mountains. Why do you like the mountains? I just like the <laughs> Around the corners where they can't fucking dodge you? No, just run up, just shoot him in the face, then I watch him go flying on the cliff. I'm, I'm sadistic. I'm, I'm a sadistic. I'll say, Joel, you're a very sadistic person. <laughs> what is your favorite thing to do in Metal Gear Solid? I like to shoot, shoot, pe shoot, a pe shoot people with a shotgun in the face and watch them go flying over the edge. Either that, or just a... Or use the shotgun to uppercut them over the air in general. So like I'll put on camouflage to make myself like 85-90% camouflage. Oh. And then I'll sneak that. up right to them, aim up, and shoot them. Okay, I did that just in case there was something down here. So I just forego stealth and just was like, if they see me, they see me. But if they don't, it's gonna suck. They're gonna die in one hit. Pretty huh? much, I don't go stealthy really in Mel in Metal Gear Solid 3, even though. Oh, so son of a bitch! Damn God. you, no squish logic. Damn it! <sighs> edit, motherfucker, <laughs> motherfuckers, you're all gonna die now. Ed, the power of edit. No, they're all gonna die now. There's no, there's no comeback from this one, Jim. My name's Joel, dumbass. Yeah, whatever you say, Jim. Don't do to that, Jim. That's mean. I will broke your nose. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck you, piranha. piranha? What piranha? Super speed. Oh shit, 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 oh shit. Yeah. Nailed it. 201. Doing good, doing good, except for landing randomly on that fucking stupid-ass lurker. Yeah, now that I think of it, you know how water's a great conductor for electricity? Yeah, the moment I land in this, I should be shocking the piss out of myself. <laughs> yeah, either that or just about everything near you. Oh, god damn it. <laughs> now I have to, have to collect those the fucking hard way, or I have to go and get myself some more blue eco. Wait, well, is, that, is that too far out? No, no, I can still do the ground via those. People are probably like, oh, show the lurker shark. I'm like, haha, no. 
No, I'm good. No. Okay, thanks. thanks. If it happens by accident, cool. You can see I'll the liquor shark. To it. Otherwise, I am not purposely doing it. Super jump! Gotcha. No, no, no. How many power cells did that make? Like 17? I have no idea. I wasn't keeping track. 16. Close enough. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Is that a blue eco vent over there? Nah. Let's get on over there. Break on through. Let's move it on over there. To the other side. Come get some. Sorry, you can. Oh my god. That's why I for you. Well, okay. That's not how physics works. Do we have boost power? Do we have boost power? Oh god. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. We got boost power. Oh no. No, we don't have boost power. Oh, we have a super vent. We got boost power. Get out of here. Motherfucker. Get ready for a platforming segment. Basic platforming. Make sure you jump a little ahead of them because they're gonna shoot back by the time you actually get near them. Yeah! I got it. Nailed it. And you can take this elevator down. Which is, should be your next option uh choice in this area. And we're going into our first dungeon. You're going to the center of the area because it's so red hot. Red hot and ready. So now we are introduced to bottomless pits. You know, those things that instantly kill you if you fall into them. You know, basic gate logic. And basic platformer logic. Luckily, Jack is a very noticeable drop shadow. Oh, look. Collectibles over perilous bottomless pits. I wonder what that makes the player want to do. Collect. Also, Jack can defy the laws of physics and jump again in there. I've only just now brought attention to that. Oh, jeez. Yeah, I'm good at platformers. I'm good at Sonic and Mario and Jack and Dick, too. Hey, look, a power cell. <gasps> oh. Okay. That was uh, That wasn't fun. <laughs> eh. Hey, I wonder what this is gonna do if I touch it. Maybe it's gonna reactivate all the blue precursor vents. Boop! Oh my god! And now all the closed blue uh, eco vents are now open. Shut up, I gotta see. Uh, connect the eco beams. Scout flies. Okay, so the only other thing I have to do in here is the Forbidden Jungle uh, boss fight. Other than connecting the eco beams. Ah! Yes, by the way, I could have died there. Okay. I just about died there. Because I was really reckless and ran over the pit when the fucking... Um, when, when that had gone upside down. There's the boss, by the way. It's time for the Forbidden Jungle boss fights. By the way, you could die before the boss even happens. Yeah, if you suck at basic platforming. Oh, yeah. Um, dumbass Edward, don't punch the things. Oh, yeah, th this is the dumbass moment on the boss's part. He keeps doing this every fucking time. He, like, gets to a certain point. Uh, little shitheads will come here. When they're spiky, don't hit them. Oh. Uh. So, Edward is being stupid. Edward's being real fucking stupid. There we go. Yeah, don't don't die to this boss. 
It's not that hard. It's, I think it's already dead. Oh, for a second I thought I, I thought I just died. By the way, you want to see something funny? I'm beating the orbs out of him. Collecting that payment. Where's my money? Where's my money? <laughs> yeah, and now we get out of here. Was that like four orbs? That was five orbs. Oh. I was pretty. I, I even gave you cheap rent out in the middle of the jungle by yourself, like you asked. And what do you do? You stiff me. You stiff me. Ow. <laughs> You stiff me time and time again and again and again and again. I give you all the patience in the world. And what do you do? You stiff me again. So you know what? Screw it. I come to kick your ass and get my wreck. And now you're dead. My name's Tyrone. I'm here to kick your ass and take your precursor orbs. Tyrone? And, oh, I, all right. Jack was going through that phase, wasn't he? My name's Tyrone. I'm here to kick By the way, power cell. Whoa. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, do that or I'm gonna kick my By the way, we have 20 off. power we have 20 power cells, so technically we could advance with the game's plot. We are missing 10 orbs. Where are those 10 orbs? Hmm. 20 minutes later. Here, she'll be coming around the mountain when she comes. Oh, it's not is there a booster pad that I like didn't oh, you know what? There, I think there totally is. It's right over here. It's this booster pad right here. Congratulations! You cleared the forbidden jungle. Can I go back up? No. Okay. I have to take the fucking deadly path again to get back up. Oh, take the long way. Since it's a shorter way, you have to take the long way. See the look on his face. He is now dying inside. That was all it was. That was all it was. It was, it was. it was just that. It was just that tiny little jump. That was all it was. Tiny little jump. All I had to do. And all I had to do was a tiny little jump. And that's that's all it was. <laughs> you had one job. Now you're fired and taking the control. You had one job. You know what your job was? Uh, to not take 10 billion years in night six. Guess what? You <laughs> did. <laughs> and you're being punished for it. Wanna know how? Yeah. You have to edit it. <sighs> now why are you crying? <laughs> you have to edit it! <coughs> <coughs> Damn it, what's up with my throat? Well, it's no longer a perfect run. We gotta start over. All the way from the beginning. From the top, boys. I couldn't do two hands. Couldn't do two hands. <laughs> and take it on the one, and the two, and the one, two, three, four. And <laughs> ah, motherfucker. You know, after I died, it's almost like I don't even care anymore. <laughs> it's like, fuck it if they hit me once. So they don't kill me again. That moment when you buy a new game and you want to purchase it. Yay! The first moment you die. Oh, God! I don't even care if I die anymore. It's pretty much without trophies in Dark Souls. Oh, <laughs> Seriously, on Dark Souls 3, it's a trophy. Don't die, you get a... You get a I know, but I mean, on your first attempt, it's just... No. No, that was... That, I was on my new game plus. The point is, I'm, I'm just saying... Even, honestly, even on even on New Game Plus, the game is so fucking temperamental. Yeah, I pr I probably should have restart and put a new file specifically for that, because even with my good equipment, I get hurt. Mm. And that's uh, early game bosses. Well, I'll, it was the only reason I died is because I got pinned by a shadow. 
Wait a minute, I just realized something. He should go tell that windbag of a mayor that he owes us big time for connecting the village at Start. Oh. Oh, it's considered a forbidden jungle power cell. Alright, I was essentially making sure about that. <laughs> 